Hey there, Ryan. So I just figured I'd do a quick little walk around video on this truck for you, give you more details on it. So it is pretty much a full load SLT. It's got the LED lights all the way around, including the fog lights and their signature C surround lighting. Park assist sensors front and rear. Uh, it's got the active aero shutters down in the grill there. So it kind of acts like a weather front when it doesn't need the extra cooling, it closes those off. And then uh, that way it directs airflow around for aerodynamics. And then uh, also in the winter time helps your engine heat up a little faster. This one has the 20 inch rims on it. It's got the running boards already. It's got your uh, lighting on the rear mirrors there or the rear view mirrors for perimeter lighting. So basically if you're doing stuff outside the truck at nighttime, you can light up all the way around the truck. Uh, it's got passive entry on all four doors. So as long as the key fob's in your pocket, you can lock and unlock the doors. Widen out the corner step there, make it a little more user friendly for work boots and winter boots. This one does have the soft uh, GMC tunnel cover on it already. Of course, the new Multi Pro tailgate, make it nice and easy for access into that box. Got the spray in box liner. It's got the 120 volt uh, plug in right in the box, LED lighting so you can see what you're doing in the box at nighttime. Added more tie down points so you got three in each corner rather than the standard one. So that gives you 12 tie down points. You shouldn't ever have an issue finding a place to uh, uh, tie things down. Locking tailgate with the key fob there. And then the dual exhaust coming out the back there. Looks very, uh, very sharp on the back. I love what they did with the look on those exhaust. As I mentioned there too, it does got the 3M on the front already. So we're gonna keep that front end looking nice, keep the rock chips down. The back seat here. So this truck does also have the GM floor mats. So the same kind of style as the WeatherTechs gonna protect that whole floor for you front and back also does come with the trailer tire pressure monitors as well which monitors your pressure and as well as your temperature vents in the back now heated seats for the two outboard ones and then a couple USB ports in the back there as well it's got your blind spot monitoring in the mirror there but you know if there's anyone coming up on your blind spot when you're driving around in the city memory seats it's got that nice real wood look to the to the trim inside not like a plasticky look. Your four wheel drive controls over here, tow haul mode, heated steering wheel, forward collision alert with low speed automatic braking. Has the lane keep assist, so if you veer out of your lane a little bit, it's just gonna gently move you back into your lane. Uh, integrated trailer brake right there, nice and easy to get at. Wireless charge pad, as long as the phone is compatible. And it's got the uh, three prong style plug-in in the front as well and then also your cigarette lighter style and then micro USB and a regular USB. It's got the built-in navigation and then also uh, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto capability. So when you plug your cell phone in with the compatible or with the USB cord, any of your compatible apps will come up right on the touch screen there. You can run Google Maps or that sort of thing. Also gives you voice activated text messaging and then all the other same kind of uh, functions that Bluetooth would do. A nice big sunroof as well it opens it up inside integrated garage door openers dual climate controls like i said this one here is a full load slt and one of our last 19s but uh let me know what you think there ryan